Many jurisdictions, either alone or together, have undertaken numerous megaprojects resulting in a global impact on global infrastructure and commercial relations. Megaprojects are attention-grabbing ventures that necessitate substantial planning as well as a bit of luck to succeed. Needless to say, even the best laid schemes sometimes go wrong. Before we begin, don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more intriguing videos like this, and be sure to watch this video till the end. Therefore, anytime we upload a new video, you'll be notified so that you won't miss out on interesting videos from us. Without further ado, let's begin. Interstate H3 USA In terms of cost per mile, Interstate H3, which runs through the Hawaiian island of Oahu, is the most expensive megaproject highway in the United States. Many native Hawaiians were furious when the environmentally harmful roadway was first suggested in the early 1960s. The megaproject did not begin until the late 1980s, and it was substantially delayed by demonstrations, environmental objections, and legal challenges. The highway was ultimately completed in 1997 after a $1.3 billion budget overrun, which is comparable to $2 billion today. But local opposition remains fierce, and many native Hawaiians refuse to use it because they believe it is cursed. Berlin-Brandenburg Airport, Germany The planning for a new airport in New Berlin began in 1989, but the vast project was not approved until 2006. Construction on the airport began the next year, with a projected opening date of October 2011. It was expected to cost 2.4 billion euros in total. However, the budget and completion date proved to be extremely optimistic. The opening date was pushed back to June 2012 in the summer of 2010. An embarrassing succession of mistakes ranging from poorly proportioned escalators to a shortage of check-in desks stalled the project even longer and pushed the budget to more than 7 billion euros. American Dream Meadowlands Mall USA The world wasn't the first significant development to stall during the late 2000s Great Recession, the American Dream Meadowlands Mall in New Jersey, formerly known as Xanadu Project, was first proposed in 2002 and has since become an American nightmare. The enormous retail and entertainment complex, which is now anticipated to cost $5 billion due to factors ranging from investor bankruptcies and legal challenges to skyrocketing expenses and construction delays, was originally scheduled to cost $1.2 billion US dollars and open in 2007. The East Rutherford Mall's construction began in March 2005, but the opening date was pushed back, and the mall's parent company went bankrupt in 2007. A series of mishandled handoffs, bankruptcies, litigation, and other challenges, including the partial collapse of the roof, have slowed the mega project even further. James Webb Space Telescope When it was designed in 1996, it was intended to be the Hubble Space Telescope's cooler, swankier, younger brother. The James Webb Space Telescope will cost $1 billion and launch in 2007. The mega project, on the other hand, has stretched on forever with the budget already reaching a stunning $9.7 billion. The JWST has been dubbed the telescope that ate astronomy for good reason by the science publication Nature. A succession of setbacks and silly mistakes, such as employing improper cleaning solvents, which broke propulsion valves and loose screws, which destabilized the telescope during tests have hurt the project. Flamanville Nuclear Power Plant Unit 3, France In 2007, the Flamanville Nuclear Power Plant in northern France began building on a new cutting-edge reactor. EDF, the French energy behemoth, budgeted 3.3 billion euros for the flagship mega project and boasted that it would be completed in four and a half years, with a target completion date of 2012. The reactor, on the other hand, remains unfinished. Setback after setback has led to the project being considerably delayed and expenses to increase, including welding concerns, steel strength issues, and even an explosion on the job site. Unit 3 is not projected to be operational until at least 2024, putting it more than a decade behind schedule, and the expenses have now grown to 12.4 billion euros. Darien Scheme, Panama Mega Project's failures are not a new phenomenon. The Darien Scheme, a disastrous megaproject that altered Scottish history, was an attempt by the Kingdom of Scotland in the 1690s to create a colony on the Isthmus of Panama and develop an overland route connecting the Pacific and Atlantic Oceans. The system was supported by an astounding 20% of all capital in circulation in Scotland at the time, amounting to tens of billions of dollars in today's money. Poor planning, inefficient management, English and Spanish opposition, and illness outbreaks that killed dozens of employees all worked to derail the enterprise. 
As a result, it is not surprising that this was overlooked in 1700. The collapse of the mega project, which impoverished the country, is regarded to have been a driving force behind the 1706 and 1707 Acts of Union, which unified Scotland and England. Expeditionary Combat Support System USA The Expeditionary Combat Support System was designed to save money, but it ended up costing the taxpayer $1.1 billion and failing spectacularly. It was created by the United States Air Force to help with supply chain management. In 2005, Oracle was recruited to conduct the work, but it was eventually acquired by the Computer Sciences Corporation. Despite enormous investments, the U.S. Air Force judged that the system was virtually ineffective in 2012 and scrapped the entire project. Carl Levin and John McCain, both senators, called it one of the most egregious examples of mismanagement in recent memory. And that's all for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please like it and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on another wonderful video from us. Till next time.